Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is another public service announcement. Because the first public service announcement did not work. And nobody listened at all to my stern warning. This is a bottle. And this bottle, it can be used to recycle. It can be recycled itself. It can be used to make other bottles. Ashtrays, windows. It can be used, you can smash it up. You can wrap your fists in cloth. You can dip your fists in glue. And then you can dip your fist into the broken glass. And then you can have a no holds barred fighting tournament in which there are rules, but the rules do not apply. <clears throat> this, uh, it can be used for that. It can also be smashed on the railroad tracks. If you kids out there want to go down a slippery, slippery slope that ain't nothing but trouble that you don't want in your life. Where eventually you end up where your your effing TV, your effing TV stand is an effing paint bucket. kids these days you drive me crazy but instead of recycling bottles what I like to do with them is I like to pretend that this isn't even a bottle it's something just completely different than that for example, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the President of the United States of America. Thank you. Thank you. My favorite English television show is Mr. B. Me and my daughters, Sasha and Malia, watch Mr. B. But you don't have to just pretend that this whole bottle is the president. You can pretend that this bottle is Johnny Rotten. Go outside that coin! The fascist rising. There is no future in England, man. I am an antichrist and I am an anarchist. Don't know what I want, but I know how to get it. I want to destroy one main reason cause I I want to be an arcade. It seems like a reasonable thing to do to pretend that a beer bottle is Morgan Freeman. I hate your rotten guts. Now you keep saying, you people, last time I checked, you're wearing a uniform. So that you people includes you. From Outbreak. Right. I'm not sure if I got that right, but 
It doesn't matter to me. Okay. Over here is FM radio. And then over here is AM radio. The distance is to highlight the difference. Okay, here's FM radio. I know it's only rock and roll, but I like it. And that was the Rolling Stones with I know it's only rock and roll, but I like it. And you're listening to Old is 94.3. We got a twin spin of the Beatles coming up for you next. And that was George Gershwin, Rhapsody in Blue, coming up in the next half hour, we've got a twin spin of Beethoven for you. And I'm John Oliver. John? Okay, over here is Cheech, and over here is Chong. No, man, you know it's Santa Claus. Yeah, I know that dude, man. We used to play with that dude, man. No, man, Santa Claus ain't no musician. Yeah, I know, man. He's terrible, man. Nah, man. You know, Santa Claus got the sled with the reindeer. Bring, 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 bring. What I've got is a particular set of skills that make me a nightmare to men like you. And I'm Scott Pelly. All this and Andy Rooney tonight on 60 Minutes. Or, uh. What about, say, Jack White? This, this would be Jack White. Any man with a microphone can tell you what he loves the most. And you know that you're not alone if you think of the Holy Ghost. Catacombs, Twilight Zones, so take a last lick of your ice cream cone. Oh, hell no, you pretty little rags and bones. Now, Meg, don't be rude. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got another one. Alright. This is the Senate hearings on organized crime. Alright, this is right over here is RFK. Then over here is Jimmy Hoffa. Now, uh, Mr. Hoffa, did you say that SOB? I'll break his back. Who? You. Say it to who? To anyone. I see skies blue. Red roses too. I see them blue. For me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world, all the colors of the rainbow. Ah! I, was, I was just toying with you. Who, who, who? Don't love my motherfucker. <laughs>